Unlocking the mystery, the meaning of getting the scoop. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of the English language. Today, we're exploring a very interesting phrase, getting the scoop. Have you ever wondered what it means and how you can use it in everyday conversations? Well, you're in the right place. Let's unravel the mystery together and add another expression to your English toolkit. Getting the scoop is an idiomatic expression that originates from the world of journalism. Imagine a reporter who finds out a piece of news before anyone else, that's essentially getting the scoop. In everyday language, it means obtaining exclusive information or learning something before others do. It's all about having that first-hand, fresh information that no one else has yet. The term, scoop, in this context dates back to the competitive nature of newspapers wanting to publish news before their rivals. It was a big deal to scoop other newspapers and get the story out first. Over time, this phrase has moved beyond the realm of journalism. Now, it's used in various situations whenever someone gets exclusive information, whether it's about a surprise party, a new product launch, or even gossip among friends. Let's look at how to incorporate getting the scoop into your everyday English. I can't wait to see Emma today. She always ends up getting the scoop on the latest office news. Did you hear about the new cafe opening downtown? I got the scoop from the owner himself. As a journalist, getting the scoop is crucial. It means you're always one step ahead. While getting the scoop is a phrase that's well understood in English-speaking countries, it's interesting to note how the idea of obtaining exclusive information is valued differently across cultures. In some places, being the first to know something carries a lot of prestige and social capital. Meanwhile, variations of this expression might include phrases like being in the know, having the inside track, or being ahead of the curve. And there you have it, a deep dive into the meaning and use of getting the scoop. We hope you found this exploration informative and that you're now equipped to use this phrase confidently in your English conversations. Remember, language learning is all about curiosity and practice, so don't hesitate to try out new expressions as you encounter them. Thank you for joining us, and we look forward to uncovering more linguistic gems together. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.